through this first uh, little setup program on your Photoshop assignment. Um, you're asked to create a new Photoshop document with these settings, size 8.5 inches, resolution 72 ppi, uh, color mode RGB, and background white. And that's where it all happens. Now when it comes up, you might have something other than inches here. You might have pixels, for an example, or you might have millimeters, for an example. Be sure you've got inches here. That's where you get it, those little things. Make sure you type in, if you don't have 8.5 here, 11 here, this is where you do your resolution, PPI. Um, and down here is where you do your color mode. If it's CMYK, you don't want that, or grayscale, or anything else. You want RGB. And then the other thing you're supposed to have is your background color. And we want to have a white one here. So let's be sure we select white. OK? Now I think we're ready. So I'm going to click OK. Now you can't see all this, so I'm going to change so that you can. I'm going to bring this down by typing in a number down at the bottom. I'll show you where I typed it. There you go. Uh, and if you can see now, basically, well, you can't because the rest of the canvas is off. Let's see if I can pull that up. Yeah, there you go. This is where I typed in 75. I had 100 and it was all off. Okay. Now what I'm going to try to do is set up those margin guides. And to do that, it's one inch margin. I come over to this uh, little ruler. And I just pull a line by holding my mouse button down so that it comes over to 1, like that, because it's a 1-inch margin. I hope you can see that blue line. I take this one over to, now this is 8.5, so it should be dropped at 7.5. Love my mouse jumped. There we go. All right. Now this way, I'll start at this ruler and bring them down 1 inch right there. And then to get an inch margin down here, I'm going to have to take it down to the 10 mark. Okay, can you see that? And that's all there is to it on that. Now, in setting it, you're asked to uh, set this to, uh, I think, the native Photoshop, yeah, PSD format. So when I go over here, I'm going to go to uh, File, Save As, and I will get a series of possibilities here. Formats, it comes up by default to a JPEG on mine. I don't want that. I'm going to put it up at the Photoshop. That's what the PSD means. So I'm going to click on that. I have the option to put a name in here, and certainly I'm going to take care of that. Um, I would put my name here, Dennis. Okay. Oh, whoops. I must have could spell it, wouldn't it? Dennis, PSD. Um, it would be nice if you would put, like, the assignment here. So I'm going to write Dennis1-1. Uh, one that first one stands for week. It's the first assignment out of the first week. Okay. So I'm ready to send it, ready to save it. Go down here, hit click, save, and lo and behold, look what I just got, this little guy right here. I don't know if you can see him or not. There he is. That's what I saved him up on my desktop, and that's what he looks like. Okay? Pretty easy, isn't it? So that ought to get you off to a nice start. Talk to you later.